That went about as good as expected. It looks like a transformer that has absolutely failed to transform. These are just gonna destroy themselves, aren't they? They're just gonna destroy themselves. That's what we're gonna happen right now. It's just... Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, this is Crab Man bringing you another episode of Trail Makers, and today we're gonna get back into it with making some crazy, ridiculous, completely impractical, and wild, wacky vehicles. I have a couple of ideas, and who knows what will stem off from that as this episode goes, but I'm looking forward to getting into it. Quick reminder before we get into it, though, if you're a fan of the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and check the links down in the description below if you want to be part of the community, or if you want to get a t-shirt or become a Patreon or something like that. Any of that stuff is always appreciated. Alright, so let's go ahead ahead and jump into it. I think first I'm gonna create, um, as close as I can to something like a weird squishy ball, maybe, that'll roll with thrusters, but probably not have that much control. I don't really know. We're gonna see what happens. Let's just get to building. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. So, this is what I've made so far, and I have no idea how this is gonna work. I don't even know if all of these things are attached to each other. This just might fall apart as soon as I spawn it in. And I also don't know if it's gonna be that laggy or not, but it was actually a lot more difficult to try to create a nice, uh, roundish kind of thing, because these, these pieces here, you can't attach them side by side. So, like, these are not attached to each other, so I had to kind of fake it by making I don't even know if this worked. I, I, I had to like make little links here and there. That's why these solid blocks are there. But we're gonna spawn it in right now and see if it fall up, falls apart or legs. Here we go. Three, two, one, spawn. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. Three, two, one, spawn. Um, it's, it's a mess. Is it, wow, I am, I, uh, it's almost kind of, I mean, I did say a squishy ball or something like that, didn't I? I feel like it's almost a success. I guess the only thing left to do is turn on the thrusters and see what happens. Well. That went about as good as expected. Um. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna I'm gonna try to. All right, let's see if we can do this. All right, repair, go. Oh, it's working. It's work. It's not working. Why didn't it work? I just want to get. I just want to get it to start rolling. Ah. Uh, all right. You know what? You know what it needs. You know what it doesn't need. Maybe it doesn't need. It doesn't need these things. Maybe it doesn't need those things. All right, here we go. I just want to see it roll down this hill. Come on, go, go, go. Go, go, go. It's working, we did a full roll. And we're falling apart. Why are those falling apart? You know what, I know how to fix this. I think this section right here is the problem section. And if I just put this in here, let's just see if that did anything. Go, go, go. <gasps> we're starting to roll down the hill. We're starting to roll down the hill. It's working. It's working! <laughs> I say as we just obliterate ourselves and lose 60% of our body mass here. I wonder which direction I came from. 
Oh, that was fantastic. I want to do that again. Let's go ahead and go back up there and do that again. Look at it just- it just falls in on itself. It's- it's like it's too fat for its own good. Alright, here we go again. Let's see if we can make it down the hill from here. Oh, oh. Yeah, there are definitely some connections that need some adjustment there. This entire thing on this side is just not even connected. What side is that? Where am I? I have no idea what I'm looking at right now. What is that? What- what is it that needs to be connected? Oh, the whole back side. I feel like maybe if I do this, hold on a sec, what if I move this up one, this up one, if I do it like this. See, now that's actually- ooh, that actually looks way better. Hmm. How interesting. Alright, so I've made a lot of adjustments to the curvature of this thing, and now I think... I think everything should be attached all the way around. There shouldn't be- Oh, I think these are actually a little bit loose, but... Uh, we'll just deal with that for now. Alright, let's go ahead and spawn this thing and see what happens. Oh, this is a little bit more like- Oh wait, no, it's okay now. It's okay now. It's still very floppy though. Alright, let's get in and uh... Let's fix it and see what happens. Alright, and go! Oh. I thought that was gonna work for a second. You know what, I feel like if we get just a little bit closer to the edge, we can get the momentum to get down. Oh, go, 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 go. Come on, come on, come on. Go, yes. Go. You know, I think some of my thrusters are facing the wrong way. I'm gonna go with, I'm gonna go with that's probably my problem. Yeah, I think these ones need to face the other direction. Go, all right, this is it, this is the one. We're going down the hill now, yes. Yes! Oh, there's so much smoke. Let's get a better view here. Then none of this is a good view. This is terrible. This is the worst idea I've ever had in this game. Maybe. I don't know. Oh, look at it fall apart. Oh, that's great. Oh, that's fantastic. It looks like... It looks like a transformer that has absolutely failed to transform. Well, one more thing with this vehicle, and then we're getting on to the next stupid vehicle. Uh, I want to actually grab this thing, I'm gonna bring it way up in the air, and I'm just gonna let it fall. We're gonna see what happens when we let it fall. Just cause I can. Alright, here we go, and fall! Here it comes! Here it comes! Uh, it didn't ex- well, I guess that kind of exploded? I don't think it actually does explode unless you're in it, but yeah, pretty much every single piece is, uh, is broken apart here. What happens if I get in the seat? Nope, I'm not attached to anything. I can't, I can't even control a single thruster with it. But yeah, this is, uh, the floppy ball, I guess I'll call it. It flops, it rolls, it falls apart, it lags. What more could you ask for, really? I mean, it's got all the- all the best features in a vehicle that you could look for. Alright, I think it's about time to move on. Okay, up next I got an idea that's probably just about as stupid. I really like using these swivel joints because they're so floppy and, like, uh, bendy. So it adds for some really interesting effects when things start going. So I'm gonna try to build somewhat of a helicopter, but instead of the blades just being on top of the spinning rotor, I'm gonna have the swivel joints be on top of the spinning rotor going out, and then the blades are gonna be on the ends of the swivel joints. So we're gonna have very, very floppy blades, and we're just gonna see what happens with that. It's pro we're probably not gonna fly, but I'm gonna try anyway. All right, let's get building. Alright, here it is. This is about this is about as much as I'm gonna do with it for now. We're gonna see how this works. Um I put two propellers or two yeah, propeller things on every single end, so hopefully we get a little bit more lift out of them. So there's a couple of possibilities here. One is that it's just not gonna work at all. Two is that I think uh the catching the air underneath the propellers is going to cause the arms to just fold up and then get all tangled. And then, of course, there's always the third option that um, it works, but... <laughs>
<laughs> no. All right, there we go. We're spawning it. We're spawning it in, 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 in. And uh, it looks like a sad starfish. But uh, we're gonna see how happy it gets when we turn it on. All right, here we go. Alright, I think I need a little bit more mass underneath it so that uh, we can actually spin the things because I didn't think about the it, uh, every force, every action has an equal, equal and opposite reaction. All right, here we go. Let's see how this does. Probably not any better. All right, it's already broken. All right, come on, we can do this. All right, stay intact. Okay, here it goes. Three, two, one. <laughs> Oh, it looks so cool, but it's not doing anything. Ah, oh, man. I really wish it would do something. Really wish it would do so. You know what? I know exactly what to do. I know exactly how to handle this. All right, here it is. It is a strange. Now there's two floppy starfishes broken. Okay, let's repair ourselves. And go. Let's see how this does. We should be a lot lighter. I got rid of some of the engines because I think they were pretty useless anyway. And wait, are the engines useless? Or are they just, I don't know if the engines actually power those things or not, but here we go. Come on, get up, get up. Uh oh, we're not getting up. Look at those propellers. Those are the most satisfying looking propellers I've ever seen. And uh, let's see if it's gonna be as satisfying to go up in the air. Here we go. It like wants to. Are they hitting each other too? We're like separating at the middle. What is that? Why is that happening? Why is our middle doing that? We got like 18 engines on here. Spin! Spin like the wind! It's not working. It's not working. It's not working at all. Oh boy. Wow. That was... It just sent us flying. One more potential solution. You see, if I select all of these, and then I just do a little bit of that, maybe that'll work. Oh, it's laggy. Look at this thing. It looks so cool. It looks like trees, like like weird willow trees or like starfish. Definitely like starfishy now. All right, here we go. These are just gonna destroy themselves, aren't they? They're just gonna destroy themselves. That's what we're gonna happen right now. It's just, uh, all right, let's get to it. Three. Two, one, go! Only one of them is where- Oh, the other one got separated, why? All right, no, repair, and go! Only one of them is spinning. Why is only one of them spinning? They should all be spinning in the same direction. So that means that they should be amplifying each other's spin, not canceling it out. I don't understand you, trail makers. I don't understand how that's working. Oh, I remembered how to change the directions of these things now. I gotta change it from the engine, not from the thing itself. Okay. All right then, I got one more solution. All right, I think we have it. I've set it up so the controls are that the opposite sides are gonna spin in opposite directions and we have eight engines per side. So they should be pretty strong and I think we're pretty lightweight other than the engines, but those are required to actually get us off the ground in the first place. Here we go. Success is gonna happen. Well, that's a bad start. All right, crisis averted. We're in action now. Okay, looking good, looking good. No lag, or not much lag at least. All right, here we are. It's very hard, I can't get in a complete view of the vehicle. All right, here we go, three, two, one. Huh. 
please. Please work. Oh no, I have to get off the ground, come on. That's not even attached over there. Why is that not attached? Why does it, it bends us in the middle? This is so, uh-oh. You know what, there's only one more solution. This is Scrap Man Problem Solver in action right here. If we're gonna make the, if we wanna make this thing fly, we are gonna make this thing fly. It's not gonna be the way I intended it to make it fly, but we're gonna make this thing fly if it's the last thing I do. All right, here we go, ladies and gentlemen. You wanted to see it fly. Well, I wanted to see it fly. We're gonna see it fly. We don't even have any of our propellers anymore. <laughs> Take me, fish. Take me away. End my misery. But to be fair, it, se it seemed like a good idea at the time. Here, how about this? Let me, oh, nope, they're, they're broken already. Come on, stay intact. Stay intact. Stay intact, please. Nope, it's broken already. We can't keep the propellers on. We just can't. It's beautiful. Okay, so those are uh, those are some of the stupidest creations I've created so far. Definitely. Um, let me know if you have any ideas for other stupid experiments because uh, definitely, definitely a fun thing to do. So again, make sure you check the links down in the description if you want to be part of the Discord, if you want to get some Scrapman merch, if you want to help support the channel through Patreon if you really, really like the channel. Make sure you're subscribed so uh, you get to see me fail at other games like this. And uh, this has been Scrapman, so I'll see you next time. Bye. Welcome to the end screen. Well, you'll probably click away before I get to tell you to subscribe for more fun. And if you really like me, but like not in a creepy way, support me on Patreon. Oh yeah, check out this awesome video I made over here. It's probably even better than this one. Or it might be worse, actually. But if you don't click it, I guess you'll never know.